Hello and welcome to the Beyond TV DVD burning plugin product demonstration, the newest add-on to Beyond TV. In this video, I'll give an explanation of what the Beyond TV DVD burning plugin is, point out some of the features specific to the burning plugin, and finally, show you the end result of a burned DVD when using the plugin. So let's get started. What is a DVD burning plugin? The new DVD burning plugin is an optional add-on that integrates seamlessly into our PC DVR software, Beyond TV, allowing you to burn your favorite recorded TV shows and movies to DVD. This means you can play your DVDs in many home DVD players and even take your shows to go. Now that we know what the DVD burning plugin is, let's get into Beyond TV and take a look at what it looks like. On the Beyond TV main menu, you'll see an option for Burn to DVD. Once in the burning list screen, to add or remove videos to the list, the buttons in the bottom right of the GUI should be used. As you can see, I've already added six recorded shows to my DVD list. The top four videos on my list are MPEG-2 format, which is the native format that Beyond TV records in, and the bottom two are in DivX and Windows Media respectively. When burning a video DVD, the Beyond TV DVD burning plugin will transcode the DivX and Windows Media files into the MPEG-2 format that is recognized by your video DVD player. Since the default recording profiles in Beyond TV are in DVD ready format, no time consuming transcoding is required when burning Beyond TV recorded MPEG-2 files to DVD. If I were to choose burn DVD right now, a few minutes later, I would have a video DVD that could be played in your home DVD player. If I would simply rather back the video files up in their native formats, I'm able to burn a data DVD instead by choosing Switch to Data Disk in the Burn menu. After I choose to burn as a data disk, the option in the Burn menu updates to Switch to Video Disk. Before I burned a DVD, you may have noticed that the disk space used is 104%. The DVD burning plugin is able to determine the amount of space you can fit on the DVD by reading the type and size of disk in your DVD writer. In this example, a 4.5 gigabyte DVD plus RW disk is being used. Since we're trying to write 4.6 gigabytes of video to DVD, we have surpassed that limit. However, with the DVD burning plugin's disk squeeze feature, that 4.6 gigabytes will automatically be compressed to fit on the 4.5 gigabyte disk. Some of the other formats that Beyond TV's DVD burning plugin supports are single and dual layer DVD plus and minus R or RW, mini DVDs, and DVD RAM disks. So let's go ahead and burn our video DVD. Note the time to burn your DVD will vary depending on the right speed of your burner and whether or not any video transcutting will need to be done. After the burning has completed, the finished burn product will look like this. Once in the main menu, it's easy to navigate to any video and select the video for playback. Since the smart chapter information that is generated by Beyond TV, i.e. the process that determines beginnings and ends of commercial breaks, is brought over to the DVD, I'm still able to skip commercials on my DVD by skipping to the next chapter from my remote control or keyboard. So that's a quick look at the new Beyond TV DVD burning plugin. Thanks for joining me. To try the plugin risk-free for 21 days, visit the following URL to download the full future trial.